yes today i'm explaining about to uh, layers and links in indesign right so create new so new file yeah i'm taking uh, suppose a4 size and create right see here instead of this a uh, one page i want to take suppose print and for a four size i want to take uh, suppose five pages right create <coughs> yeah these are the five pages right the same thing you can find from the a uh, page panel so 1 2 3 4 5 yes in indesign actually what are the layers and links <coughs> actually these are the important things in indesign suppose a layer suppose uh, on this layer panel right suppose this is my the first a uh, page here i want to create uh, something right this is my page so here i'm trying to uh place some text here yeah this is my uh, text area and here i'm giving 24 point and right click here and insert a uh, placeholder text fill with the placeholder text right <coughs> this is and suppose see here showing here the layer 1 inside this is your uh, text right so that means what it is creating sub layers right and this is your entire a uh, layer right here you can give any name to this suppose here i'm giving uh <coughs> head h e a d a head i'm giving or otherwise take any name <coughs> main the main area i'm giving right and suppose here if you want to change this a uh, color text color or otherwise this uh <coughs> the layer color i want to give in red right and here lock is there and print and show guides lock guides there are the options right say okay and now see this layer is showing in that red color uh here in this again i want to create one box here right so this is my box and i want to fill this box with uh, some red color okay now you check this inside so this is your text and this is your <coughs> box right here suppose if you want to lock this one you can lock this one so when you lock this you cannot move this suppose here it is showing right or otherwise right click on that and say lock also here the lock symbol is visible just unlock that or otherwise come here and lock also and unlock also <coughs> right and suppose here it is showing see click to select items suppose you click here and you are selecting your text here right now you click here you are selecting this so only that portion you can move if you want right yes and this is what suppose indicates current drawing layer right it is indicating current drawing layer see if i click on this red item in the current layer uh, suppose see i'm deselecting this see these two sub layers are in main area right so here i want to select this suppose see what i'm doing there is a click to select items just click on that 
so two items at a time because you select that main layer that inside sub layers are uh, selecting continuously right and right this you can unlock and here <coughs> some other portion I want to add some photograph here right so what I'll do here see after locking this in this space this is the main area and suppose this is the middle and suppose this is the bottom portion right so area wise the important and area wise I'm dividing this whole layout into three groups the first one is main area the middle area and the last area and here over on that right click and create new layer right otherwise see the bottom create new layer yeah created new layer <coughs> in this new layer so I want to add some photograph right so here apply place right and drag this one and open open this and give your size actually which size you want yes perfect this is my picture I added <coughs> sorry and I'm adding one more text lines here so that to uh, yeah I want to add some text about the picture so instead of 12 I'm using 18 point and right leg fill with the placeholder text right so this is <coughs> these two items already included in this new layer so the new layer means here what this one so give this name here double click here and give them a layer name the middle area middle area I'm giving right and this uh, layer color is suppose blue I'm taking I'm using the same right so it is in red and this is in blue right and lock this and here create one more layer or otherwise right click and new layer a new layer that is and this is a bottom area bottom area I'm giving say okay yes in this bottom area again I'm creating I'm placing a one more picture right this is something like yes okay open I open here and drag and choose your area okay this is nice in this area I want to fill with the some the color so I'm taking this box here so I want to fill with some color right so if you observe here these two layers also add in this right okay so you can lock this so in this manner in this way you can create all the pages suppose in one page see in one page these are the things included right in one page page this is main area top area and this is the middle portion and this is bottom right if you observe this in layers you will understand this is this is and this is you can uh, <coughs> category wise the area wise alignment wise and your layout wise you can uh, divide these layers right within the layers uh, your actual sub layers are there okay very good so here you create a one more layer here <coughs> suppose and now I want to add 
something in the second two three third page Th third and uh, yeah two and three here I'm importing I'm placing the pictures right uh, suppose this picture and suppose uh, this picture open so this is here and suppose this is here right these are the two pictures <coughs> and here in this space third page again I'm creating text placeholder yeah this is my text here <coughs> and here I'm planning I'm using one more photograph place right yes I'll use this one yes yes and drag and and drop this picture uh, suppose this is yeah this is yeah if you observe here see it is adding into this another a new layer right so layer wise if you observe it is but here in pages it is showing in suppose second page and third page and next here links about links what are the links see we already use some photographs here mostly uh, these links can work can affect with the photographs because the source file if you change that uh, source file uh, maybe your source file are there and desktop or any C drive if you give any modification to the source file so automatically that source because of the source is modifying in indesign also your file your uh, the photograph can, can uh, modify according to that right <coughs> see here the photographs are placed itself by number wise see one one two two so three three so what are these actually so two ones two ones means what suppose if I click on this I symbol I mean uh, hand symbol see in the first page here actually two photographs we used so that is the reason this is one and this is a two right the two photographs the one and I want here suppose if I click here see this is your uh, second page in second page they're showing two photographs right and this is third in third page it is there <coughs> so it is very easy to find your photographs from pages suppose uh, sometimes you can work with uh, many pages like uh, 30 pages 50 pages and 100 pages you are working on a magazine or a book right so there we use uh, a lot of many photographs in mostly on all the pages will cover with uh, uh, photos sometimes you want to uh, change or modify some photo uh, from the particular page so how to find that particular photo uh, from uh, the many uh, pages like uh, in hundred pages book right suppose here by clicking on this uh, one so directly you select that you come to that a picture right and here it is see because the picture is selected it is showing here the link name the name is Athena and format JPEG page 1 and color space is RGB status ok size and regarding the all information every information is showing about picture suppose here it is minimized or otherwise <coughs> suppose you can show your cursor there it is showing that and uh, that minimum information there or otherwise I right click here and suppose there are options the relinking options this and all right so here 
select and see your information about information and here see it is showing I click on this and find this numbers are changing from bottom to top now click this from bottom it is selecting in the last second third page that it is there in third page right and here it is in second page and here it is in second page so by clicking on this the order it is showing order right so from 1 to 3 or otherwise from 3 to 1 means top to bottom pages or bottom to top pages you can choose how you want <coughs> okay and again suppose <coughs> it is showing how many links are there here actually right it is showing so 1 2 3 4 5 links 1 2 3 4 5 links so 5 links are <coughs> showing so is the links information right see for all the uh, five links it is showing okay yes <coughs> next suppose here and here suppose if you observe is a reeling reeling from CC libraries reeling and it is go to link and update link and edit original the same thing available here suppose in right click also suppose relink suppose it is a relinking with the another picture suppose here I am taking this and open see this picture actually here before it was another picture it is a relinking with right this is and <coughs> uh, here again a right click and relink from CC libraries right so if you connect with the internet you can relink from a CC libraries so copy link to suppose you can copy links <coughs> so you can select the folder actually it is uh, here. so copy link so from there it is copying link right so here this is uh, go to link again right yeah it is quoting link and suppose it is uh, embed link so here it is that embedding means what uh, directly your picture is embedded so it is no more link it has no link it is embedded into your program right an embed link so that means what so it is telling an embed link to the original file or it can be linked to files to create in a folder do you want to link to the original file yes <coughs> right so it is unlinked now so un unembedded right and here it is uh, show link information panel so that is the link information panel that means about uh, that link and about that picture and edit original suppose this picture here you can edit suppose by using this draw you are doing you are <coughs> editing your original and suppose here edit with the 
illustrator or in design photoshop by using the softwares you can edit that picture suppose reveal in explorer suppose here i am using see this is my picture here right so what i am doing here <coughs> see that picture actually we uh, selected this orange uh, folder right the before selection this picture we stored and we kept in uh, orange is a folder so it is linked with that folder here what i am doing so i'm changing this name suppose with some a a right a a <coughs> and minimize this and if you observe this see here it is showing something missing double click to relink so that means what because you change that name because of that original source file is name change so it is questioning what about this what is that right so in double clicking the and that link <coughs> and suppose here i'm adding this right so it is replaced by that one see because already we replaced it in two sides so here not here here this is and this is previous already we used that okay <coughs> so the same way you can edit reveal in bridge also always copy information right the captions just you can leave this so reveal explorer so that means what if you want to add or modify that original picture <coughs> right that original picture so automatically that file can modify here also right suppose uh, i want to yes this is the picture we will in explorer yes you can change this in name or otherwise this time what i am doing just i am deleting i deleted this right now see it is showing what missing because from the source folder you deleted that original source image so that is the reason it is these are uh, remarks this corrections right so <coughs> and again if i suppose this is if i restore this again because it is there it is already in my recycle so if i restore that so what is that this is a right click and a restore i restored this and check with uh, in design now see <coughs> that remark that red question mark is gone so that means links you can add you can change and you can replace right replaceable all these things so mostly we use links on multiple pages multiple images there easily by clicking this number page suppose this is two page in two page how many pictures are there this is one this is one and suppose uh, this is another one and third page this is right to find and select easily your pictures from multiple pages from multiple images easily we use this links right so this is about uh, layers and links right this is uh, very easy to understand <coughs> in the next class i'll explain about new subject right thank you